I hear a name like Albert, Albert, Albert. Who is that person? Albert, where is the person? Is he coming out? The person is not feeling fine. That's what God showed me. The person is not feeling fine. Am I right? Come, let me pray for you. General Overseer. Mama Tony. Yes, my papa. I hope you are not wearing high heels. Papa, look at it at the corner. Okay. I've Young man, how are you? The Lord bless you. Amen. Come and stand here. How did you locate this church? It's my cosmate. Your? My cosmate. Your cosmate? Yes. That saw the church? Yes. He online? Came, he came here last week. Okay, your cosmate come here last week. Yes, sir. You are the one? Yes, sir. Okay, this is your cosmate. Yes. He's the one that brought you yes, sir. to come. Yes, sir. The Lord says I should pray for you. Thank you, sir. Because what I'm seeing concerning you, your life is in danger. My the, father this thing I'm seeing is an accident. Yes, sir. Talk to me. Yes, sir. It was an accident. Yes, the accident almost took his life. Yes, sir. You survived by the grace of God. Yes, and this thing affected your leg yes, sir. and your bone. Yes, sir. But after today, I declare healing upon your life. Power! I see you putting on uniform. Is it Nigerian army? Yes, sir. Nigerian army. Yes. General overseer. Yes, you say you are the one that brought him. Yes, sir. God show me. I see him with army uniform. Yes, sir. And his name is Mr. Albert. Yes, sir. God told me it is from the village. From his father's house. I saw where they wrote his name and they kept it somewhere in Gombe State. My father help him. Deliver this man. If you want to shout fire, shout it louder. When this accident happened, you thought you were dead. Yes, sir. Because your spirit left your body. Yes, you are still alive by the grace of God. Yes. I have come to declare, you shall not die. Amen. I thought I had this just shout that amen like thunder. Amen. I say you shall not die. Amen. You have already escaped death. Amen. I move into that altar where they kept your name. And I decree in the name that is bigger than every other name. If I hear this church shout the loudest amen, I destroy that altar. Amen. Who is it to you? He's your husband. Yes, sir. Thank God you are here. The attack was to kill him. But God kept him. The Lord told me the attack is from whom? Because he's here, I'll pray for him. He has escaped the death. Amen. After this accident, this thing happened about two months ago. After this accident, are you hearing me? Yes, sir. The Lord told me you've been praying and you've been taking a lot of medication. Yes, sir. But instead of getting better, if you do as if you want to get better today, tomorrow it will get worse. Yes, you know why? They yes. took an animal and they broke the two legs. Yes. I want to pray for you now to undo what they have done. So that when you take medication, your body will accept treatment. God bless you, man of God. Give me one blessed water. Power not be power there. Amen. Amen. Lift your hand as I pray for you. Okay, open your mouth. I declare healing. Amen. Drink the water. I declare healing. Amen. Drink the water. I declare healing. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. God bless you. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. You shall not die. Amen. You have escaped death. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Please, uh, protocols, allow him to see me when they close. God bless you. Amen. How many Michael are here? God bless you, God bless you, God bless you. Oh God, you are not feeling fine. I should pray for you. Come and stand here. For some time now, almost two years, you don't understand your body system. At all. Sometimes your leg go do as if you want to break. This particular one. They pack sand from your leg. Man of God, please help me. I saw an evil hand that packed sand from your leg. Lift up your hand. Can I pray for somebody here? If you are here, somebody shout, I'm here. There is a casket moving here. Holy Ghost. I say, Holy Ghost. I say, Holy Ghost. Let's pray against the spirit of death. I saw a casket here. Lift up your hand. Say every arrow of death. Wherever you are coming from. Back to sender. Is there anybody like Patrick here? Now you. <laughs> you too, you are Patrick. He never allowed me to talk. He says he's the one. My father scan them. You are the professional scan. Need down, your time has come. Amen. Meanwhile, I will pray for you. In Anibo, 
Are you from Imo State? Yes, I'm from Imo State. Oh, where are you? Oh, where are you? Knee down. Prophetic General, God bless you. You were doing well in business before. Yes, that's After right. a while, everything turned upside down. Up to now, it's a woman that tied you. Fire! Man of God, please help him. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. You are into business. Yes, we're... Things were moving well. Boutique. I saw you selling something like wears. Yeah, I sell boutique. You had a boutique yes, where they sell clothes. Yes. It's a woman that tied down your business. Fire! He said, come and move forward. Let me see. I release Holy Ghost. I release Holy Ghost. I release Holy Ghost. I'm coming. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Yes, sir. You have people around you that can help you, but they don't want to help you. That is the major challenge. People that have money, they are around you. Plenty, so many. And even when they make promise to you, no to fulfill way. the promise is I a problem. Have to many countries. You have traveled to many countries. Everything scattered. scattered. It is because they tie you somewhere. Just give me your hand. Every bondage. If I hear the loudest amen, I lose that bondage. I say 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 I lose that bondage. In the name of Jesus. Sometimes you feel cobwebs covering you. Yes. This is witchcraft. Every time they see you close to your destiny helper, they stand in between you and your destiny helper. My two of my brother called me yesterday. Uh -huh. They said I should not come, for, come home for the election. They will assassinate me. They will kidnap me. Because of that, I can't Nobody kill can kill you after this prayer. Yeah. I want to be powder. As I bless this water, I decree the case is settled. Yeah. Take this water. Go to the front of the church. Wash your face, your hand, and your leg. Come back. When they close, enter my office. Power. Settled. God Young man. You. Gabo. You know what I'm talking about. Yes, they true. tied you. And they don't want you to move from where you are. The Lord says you release you. Amen. There was a time you were having money. Yes, that's but true. after a while, everything turned upside down. Yes, the Lord says you bring you out of that bondage. Anybody God. like Alade here? Yes, Alade? God you have been through a lot in life. Even the people you helped when you have, they all disappointed you. And they turned their back at you. He got to a point, you start asking God questions. You say, God, where are you? The Lord said, I should pray for you for restoration. First October, I was in Billy. Oh my God, I was in Yuri, Mercy City. I spent a week there to do a bit. So I was watching the man of God there from YouTube. After he finished the, the, the divine confirmation ministry, I was just watching her from my phone. I watched. I keep on watching, and I found out this thing is from Abuja here, and I went all the way from Lambata, from Niger State, down to Delta State. That was 1st October I was there, hmm. till one week before I could live there. So I, when I came back home, I continued watching you. I continued watching. I said, no. If I can move all the way from Niger State down to Delta State in Abuja here, let it be my backyard. And I come with faith that this is because you are under this anointing. Listen, that devil that kept you under bondage before today. If you just shout the loudest amen, the yoke is broken. I said the yoke is broken. Listen, your time has come. You have cried for too long. A time before you used to have money. People come to you, you are the one that gives to them. But it got to this point now. You don't even understand yourself anymore. I don't understand. They attacked you and they attacked okay, your finances. I will sit in my shop as if I sit in the bush. God punish the devil. Amen. Go to front of the church. Pack sand. Bring it for me. Hey. If I bless the sand, take it back to your shop. I want to be proud of God bless you, man of God. Hey, Mr. Patrick. They just sent me your, your, your video. Program. Yes. On WhatsApp day before yesterday. You just saw the thing on WhatsApp day before no, yesterday. No, somebody sent me from Oweri. From Oweri? Yeah, then he told me that he's in Papi. I he's said, in okay, Papi? Okay, since I'm in Maraba, I will be coming to Papi and worship today. Are you serious? Four o'clock, I, I press my cloth. Six, I enter motor to me, for me to... I saw a boutique shop you used to have. I have a boutique in Kabai. And God told me there was a time business was moving for you. Yes. It's a woman that locked you down. Fire. My father helped him. 
I want to bring you out from where they tie you. Oh, yes. 